Welcome to the NCDWI Guy podcast, where defenders of the Constitution assemble to prepare for courtroom battle, and firm owners gather to develop marketing strategies that will revolutionize the practice of criminal defense. Here's your host, the NCDWI Guy, Jake Minnick. Hello, fellow freedom fighters, and welcome to episode 137 of the NC DWI Guy podcast. Big episode, historic episode, because today we announce that coming your way in 2023 is the inaugural Freedom Fighter Summit. Inaugural Freedom Fighter Summit. This is going to be hosted in Asheville. And what we are putting together is a two-day summit that is going to focus on building your business, creating a wow experience for your clients, uh, creating the right culture in which your team can thrive, figuring out how to build a better law practice. Day one, we're going to focus on building your brand. Uh, how how do you build your, your personal brand, your firm brand? Uh, Day two, we're talking about creating the right culture. How do you uh, uh, figure out hiring, firing? How do you create an environment in which your team can thrive? And I have locked in a star-studded list of speakers for this event. Very excited about the people that we have coming to present in 2023. We're going to start announcing speakers in December. And we'll continue revealing speakers into uh, probably April of next year, who's going to be speaking at the summit. But it's going to be an absolutely amazing event. Uh, we're, we're doing this at the Hilton in Biltmore Park in Asheville. Beautiful venue, beautiful uh, location to do the event, Asheville, but also a great, great place a little bit outside of downtown Asheville. Tons of restaurants uh, in the Biltmore Biltmore Park area. Um, a great environment, entertainment. Uh, beautiful, beautiful spot to do this event. So, if you are looking to uh, use 2023 uh, to take your law practice to the next level, you do not want to miss out on the Freedom Fighter Summit. So. How can you find out more information about the Freedom Fighter Summit? Well, you're going to go uh, check out uh, the website, which is minniclaw.com forward slash summit. That's minniclaw.com forward slash summit. That's where we'll be making most of the announcements about our star-studded speaker lineup. That's where we're going to be um uh, uh, giving you the details on how to get signed up, where to, where to book your, your hotel room and all of that. So go check that out. But this is going to take place on Thursday, October the 19th and Friday, October the 20th of 2023, Thursday, October 19th, Friday, October 20th. And that is judges conference week. So if you're thinking, well, maybe I should hold off on, uh, on this and, and wait and see what my court calendar looks like, put it on the judges uh, conference week so that you don't have to rearrange anything. It'll be, it'll be, uh, an easy event to plan around. Um, don't, don't, don't plan any vacations, uh, that far in advance. But one of the things that I've, I've always, uh, I wish there would be a little bit more of an announcement on is that some of the the best CLEs that I've, I've wanted to attend haven't gotten announced until, um, you know, uh, weeks or, or months, uh, just a few months before the event went live. And so, uh, we wanted to, to make sure that we had everything locked in. The planning was, was ready to go. So it's going to be an incredible, incredible event. Uh, the, uh, only, only limitation that we have right now is space in terms of, in terms of the venue, basically the, the, the venue that we picked can comfortably hold a hundred people. We have about 80 tickets that are going to be available and those are going to go fast. So if you want to lock in your, um, your ticket for the freedom fighter summit, don't miss out on doing that now. 
you're going to have to you're going to have to be one of the uh, one of the first people that pulls the trigger to make sure that you get into the freedom fighters summit um uh, if you use uh, when you check out on the go, go to the website and that'll send you to the uh, 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 ticket we're using Eventbrite for our ticketing. Um, uh, so go check out the website and that that'll shoot you over to Eventbrite to get registered. If you use the promo code NCDWI guy, NCDWI guy, no spaces, all lowercase, you're going to get $150 off your ticket for the summit. So go, uh, go get signed up again. I think early adopters on this, um, uh, uh are, are going to be rewarded because there is a limited amount of space. We are not moving, um, the event. It has taken a lot of uh, time to get all of the speakers lined up schedule wise and to make sure that we were going to have a good space. So, uh, that is kind of max capacity for the venue that we're doing it at this year. So make sure you don't miss out. It's, it's, uh, it's been a week of signing up for, for, uh, stuff mostly related to, to Christmas, right? We had black Friday after Thanksgiving, then small business Saturday, uh, Cyber Monday, Giving Tuesday. Well, today is Wonderful Wednesday because it is the first day that you can sign up for the Freedom Freedom Fighter Summit uh, next year. So, um, where where did this where did this kind of arise out of the idea for this? Well, I'll, I'll give a little bit more details in the coming weeks in terms of kind of what my thought process was for this. But there is not a conference that I have seen that focuses on building your criminal defense practice. This is a a legal conference that is designed for owners of small law firms. Uh, uh, you know if, if you're if you are if you own your own law firm, uh, criminal defense firm, if you are thinking about stepping out on your own and opening your own law firm, there there are a lot of legal conferences out there that focus on kind of building your business. But a lot of uh, a lot of times they're either general in nature in terms of it's not really focused on one particular practice area uh, versus the next, um, uh, or, or it it just does not seem to kind of fit into what we're doing. This is really geared towards helping us primarily in this state, uh, state of North Carolina, uh, helping criminal defense lawyers up their game by upping their law practice. That's the goal of this of this summit. And I think you're going to walk away from this summit with just a renewed uh, energy, a renewed enthusiasm for how you deliver your services to clients. Uh, not only not only is there going to be again an amazing lineup of speakers that are going to have you know uh, j- just the, these monumental breakthroughs mentally on how to improve your practice that they're going to be talking about through each topic that is covered at the summit, but also hanging out with other attendees at the summit is going to be an extremely um, powerful experience. And we're going to figure out some ways that we can kind of create a, a, a way for owners to, to kind of maintain contact following the summit, you know, bounce ideas off of each other. But I think that the relationships that are going to be created at this event are going to be uh, just incredible as well. So I'm um, very excited about this, about this summit. Again, the, the uh, venue is not going to get bigger uh, for, for 2023. We we have got everything locked in, got people's schedules locked in. Um, uh, it, it was amazing. I reached out to a number of local hotels in Asheville um, uh, over the past several months, going back into the summer. And it is a difficult Thing to find a um, a, a venue uh, in the the range that we are looking at in the fall season because that's when people are scheduling weddings and other big events and so it's a it's a um, uh, a hard time to lock in a summit so it's going to be in the fall in beautiful Asheville if you want to extend your stay into Saturday or Sunday you're going to get to spend some time in the beauty of the mountains. Um, following uh, all of the all of the great 
information and relationship building that's going to go on on Thursday and Friday. So, so make sure that you take advantage of that. But uh, to just to just give a, a little bit a little bit of, of more of of the kind of feel of the event. This is not a traditional CLE. There's going to be no uh, continuing legal education credit for this. Um, the primary reason for that is that uh, in North Carolina for continuing legal education, you cannot get credit for a, 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 uh, uh, an hour or an event that is uh, focused on marketing. So if the program is marketing focused, CLE is not allowed. This is going to be marketing. This is going to be branding. This is going to be firm culture improving your practice. So that's you know not not only what uh, one one hour of the event is going to be focused on. The entire thing is going to be focused on uh, building building your firm, building your practice. So no CLE hours. Um, uh, this is not a good event if you uh, are coming to it to dabble. So if you're just kind of interested in seeing what's out there and kind of going in um, you know, with, with a mindset of, I'll kind of take out of it what I can get out of it, this is not a CLE for you, or this is, this is not a summit or, or a conference for you. This is for somebody that is all in on wanting to improve their practice. If you're planning to, uh, to work while you're at this conference, Please don't sign up. Uh, if if you're if you're planning to have your laptop, uh, your phone with you to look at, please don't sign up for this this conference. This is for people that are all in on taking their business to the next level. This is a uh, kind of an expensive summit for us to put together between the cost of uh, the the venue, uh, speaker fees, some of the uh, materials that we're going to have together for the summit. This is going to be a break-even event for us. We're not making money. I'm not making money on this event. It's a, a event that that is is really uh, designed from from my end of things of wanting to help other committed law firm owners elevate the game of their business. So uh, the, the 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 reason I'm putting this on is because I believe that the number one way that criminal defense attorneys in North Carolina can uh, get a better name collectively for themselves, that can um, uh, uh, ha have a better representation for clients in our state across the board is through improving our law practices. Again, go, go to every CLE that you possibly can to elevate your knowledge in the courtroom of DWI law, of uh, criminal defense representation. Absolutely. We encourage at the firm here, uh, CLE hours and making sure that we are, you know, at the, at the, you know, always sharpening the sword when it comes to being ready to go to battle in the courtroom for clients. So do not, do not, uh, uh, you know, replace CLE hours with this this conference. For, first of all, you get a nasty gram from the from the state bar because you got to get those credits knocked out. But secondly, you're doing yourself a major disservice if you are not advancing your knowledge within the courtroom. But uh, we also have a responsibility to our clients to deliver an exceptional client experience. We have a responsibility to the people that are working in our firm, to our partners, to our associate attorneys, to our paralegals, to the people answering the phone. We have a responsibility to making the work environment as strong and solid a place to work as possible because that is felt by the client. That is ultimately something that the client feels. So again, if you are 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 signing up for uh, this this conference or thinking about signing up for this conference, and uh, you you are not prepared to go all in, you are not prepared to check your phone, your laptop at the door, and be completely committed to the experience and to the other uh, attendees in terms of you know putting your full attention into the conference. Um, uh, using that two-day period to completely advance your firm, please don't sign up. This is only for for the for the uh, firm owners that really want to take their law firm, their legal practice 
to the next level and deliver an exceptional experience for clients. So again, excited to announce our, our speakers over the over the coming uh, months. It's going to be a fun, fun thing to reveal periodically, but don't wait. Don't wait to sign up because we have a limited number of, of seats for this. Uh, this is this is a a project that I have a ton of personal investment in and plan to really uh, uh, use it as a way to give back to the criminal defense community. And, and I am super pumped about it. Very excited about this, this, uh, this summit. Um, so, so go to miniclaw.com forward slash summit, check out there, the website, get signed up. And I look forward to seeing you in October, 2023.